afternoon water signs pisces cancers and scorpios this is your girl spreadsheet black coming to you to land i hope all is well with you and your little family today i'm coming um here to give you guys an energy update but i will be doing your signs um separately so we will start off with pisces then work our way to cancers and then last but not least will be scorpios please do not forget to like subscribe share comment if the content fits for you okay so let's get started so uh i've already done two other elements and there's a lot of transformation energy that's going on within um a lot of signs so i mean i know with with it being the new year getting ready to come about you feel me hey aren't we ending some shit that is no longer serving our higher good <laughs> Water signs. First, so get us some messages for your Pisces. Give me three cards for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Give me three cards for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for Pisces. Okay, Pisces. First card you guys have is the Ace of Pentacles. So, ooh, maybe some money's coming your way, honey. Maybe some good fortune's coming your way. Some wealth, stability. Um, a new job's probably coming in for you. You know what I'm saying? Take what resonate. Even I, I look at this card as good energy as well. You feel me? Because... Yeah, that's just my little personal shan thing. But yes, um, good energy's coming in for you. You know what I'm saying? Stability. Stability. I'm sorry. Stability's coming in for you. Next card, Pisces, you guys have is the lover's card. So this could be uh, a Gemini is coming towards you. This is soulmate energy. Um, this is a relationship is um, starting off for you. Or maybe you're in a relationship now and you guys are figuring out that you guys are soulmates at the end of the day. This is also twin flame energy as well i believe twin flame energy so maybe you could be dealing with your twin flame right now take what resonates okay um like i said you also could be dealing with the gemini this is the gemini uh, card in turret world <clears throat> the last card you guys have pisces sun moon rising and venus so you guys um could be going through um something that was like drastically like they had hurt you you know what i'm saying you're coming out of it you know um or either you're needing to come out of it this is your energy something that hurt you but spirit is telling you that you cannot stay in that energy for too damn long so now that you know what's going on it's time to clear it out pisces cancer and scorpio i hope that resonates with i mean i'm sorry that's just for the pisces i apologize it was just for the Pisces. I hope that resonated with y'all. So, sure, give me some messages. Give me three cards for your Cancers. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for Cancers. Three cards for Cancers. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus on our energy update. What's going on with your Cancers, Spirit? I just try to do something different. Oh, shit. I can't stand when this do this. I will take... Why did this do that? Hold on, Spirit. Let me start this over. Let me start over. Cancers. Cancers. Energy update for the Cancers. Give me one more card for your Cancers. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Mm. I'll take that one. Cancer, so we have the justice card in the reverse. So maybe you guys are needing to gain some type of justice, or maybe you're feeling like maybe in a relationship, maybe a job, maybe within yourself. You feel me? You're not gaining some type of clarity, some type of truth about something. You feel me? Even balance at the end of the day. Uh, that's also the Libra card. So you guys could be dealing with the Libra as well. You know what I'm saying? Something's not coming the way that it needs to come what do we look as justice is like something being served you know something's not being served this could be something in a legal matter like i said a relationship divorce whatever counselors um the next card you guys have is the six of pentacles in the reverse so the six of pentacles in the reverse usually symbolizes that somebody is giving more to the other um maybe this is a relationship this could also symbolize um a job like maybe you supposed to be getting paid, you know, more than what you, you know, that you're getting paid right now. You know what I'm saying? Take what resonates. Um, it could also be within yourself. You know what I'm saying? You're not 
you're giving your love to everybody else instead of yourself. You're giving your finances and shit to everybody else instead of yourself. Take what resonates, cancers, okay? Or if this could, this could also symbolize, I don't know where this came from. This could also symbolize that you feel like uh, your partner, maybe maybe they're giving, they're giving to somebody else instead of you. <coughs> Take what resonates, cancers. I apologize. The last card that you guys have is the King of Swords. So this is, this could be you are in your power. Like this is you are speaking up for yourself. You know what I'm saying? Are you needing to speak up for yourself? Um, some clarity needs to be spoke. Some truth needs to be spoke at the end of the day. Take what resonates, Cancers. I don't know, okay? That is the energy update for Cancers. So last but not least, we have Scorpios, Water Signs. Please, once again, do not forget to like, subscribe share comment if the content fits for you okay energy update for scorpios give me three cards for scorpios i just have to pick it up pick it up pick it up pick it up sorry give me three cards for scorpios i'll take that first card give me three give me two cards for scorpio sun moon rising and venus Give me one more card for Scorpio. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Okay, Scorpios. The first card you guys have is the Eight of Pentacles. So are you guys working on a project? Are you wanting to work with somebody at the end of the day? Are you working um, on yourself? You know what I'm saying? You're working on your own foundation. you planning and trying to put things in order. You know, like getting your ducks in order. Get your ducks in a row. That's what it. That's what it was, Scorpios. This is the nine of swords in the reverse. So, are you guys coming out of being worried about something? You know, have you prayed about it and and decided that you're not going to worry about it anymore, Scorpios? You're letting go and letting God at the end of the day. You know what I'm saying? You're not staying up late anymore, crying about that situation, that person, or whatever it was that was not serving your higher good. Take what resonates. Last card you guys have, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, is the Three of Pentacles. So the Three of Pentacles symbolizes this is teamwork. So like I, like I said, you got the Eight of Pentacles, and then you got the Three of Pentacles. So it could be you want to uh, come together, collaborate with somebody. This is the energy that you're in right now. You know what I'm saying? It's somebody around you. This is also um, uh, symbolizing like... Did I say a project already? I'm sorry, Scorpios. But yeah, teamwork. Maybe you want to collaborate with somebody. You want to come in with somebody, do something with them, work on a project, a relationship. You feel me? So yes, water signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. So I'm rising in Venus. This is your girl, Spiritually Black, coming to you two land. Um, that was an energy update, a little snippet for you guys. Once again, um, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, comment if the content fits for you. If it doesn't, it is what it is. Please continue to keep growing and glowing and moving and grooving and just being the happy person that you are and continue to keep vibing high. This is your girl, Spiritually Black, signing off.